Hey, my name is Andre, and I want to show you basic techniques, some dirty tricks on the octa track that I use. And here's my latest video. I played live at the Fête de la Musique and used something like granular synthesis. It goes in this direction. Have a look. So all I did there was record something. You can record guitar, your voice, or in my case now a piano. And I start with a MIDI track and start recording. After that, I put this into a flex machine. And then I use the um, retrick and retime values and the start value to achieve something like a granular effect. So let's start. this into a flex machine. Okay, then I can now turn off the MIDI track and set a trick on the flex. And this, with these parameters, the start, the retrick and the retiming, I can now start to achieve something like a granular just a little piece of the audio file and mingle with it. Just have a look. start point around to find something good One, two, three, four. and then add a beat to modulate 
one of the things. Now the LFO is changing the start value of the sample. Maybe an arpeggiator. Also use a scene, a scene adjustment to um, achieve the same effect. As I said, there are a million ways. I just um, deactivate the LFO. So I have one scene here and one scene on scene B. And if I go to my track settings, put the start point at zero and the start point here at 127. You could also use the retrick to change. The cool thing is it interpolates between in the crossfader. So you can find a sweet spot on coincidence. Yeah, that's basically it. Uh, some granular techniques on the Octatrack. Thanks for watching.